Hello guys and welcome back to Borderlands 2 Commander Lilith DLC. Hope you enjoyed episode 1 and now we're going to continue. So you cowards teamed up with that bandit from Helios? Figures. They gave up their moonshot cannons real easy. Now I can launch my paradise gas wherever my eye can see. Adapt and reuse. That's called strategy. You know. If you ever want to taste victory for a change. I'm so ready to kill that guy. Get Tannis those samples, killer. I'll keep rounding up the raiders. Tannis, I couldn't find you after the attack. You somewhere safe? Oh, yes. I'm secure in one of my many hidden panic shelters. Handy when you live in a constant state of panic. Hmm. Let's change it up a little bit. Nah, we'll leave it for now. Enough small talk. Get me those samples and we'll have a plant monster army of our own in no time. We just need an antidote. <sighs> Fine. Honestly, sometimes you people make no sense whatsoever. Get ten of those samples, killer. I'll keep rounding up the raiders. Outfit. Sending assassins after him is just my way of keeping in touch. A little more personal than a mercenary day card, you know? You know? Hey, I asked you a question, diary! I'm so sorry, Captain! I got distracted! Well, 
Time to play Dodge the Blowtorch! <laughs> By the way, a lot of people don't like him. He sounds very similar to the old one, so I'm not really too bothered by it. Oh, we do have cars in this, thank God. while fighting within a gas pocket. Strange, but potentially helpful. Do keep a close eye on your exposure level. Unless sprouting vines and losing your mind is a newfound kink. In which case, I'll have some echo novels for your perusal. Judgment-free zone. Look for closed bulbs. I need pure specimens. I see the gas has infected the local fauna as well. Vault Hunter, try obtaining samples from those infected skags. I like these cool little effects. at an exponential rate. 
In dumb speak, gas make tiny plant go big, big, and do the ouch. She's so patronizing. <laughs> Where are you? Genetics I can only describe as brilliant and arousing. Now we must discern how the gas is infecting humans. I will require samples, specifically brain matter, which I like to call that good gray stuff. You gotcha!
I lack the expertise necessary to synthesize the gas and create our own legions of plant-human hybrids. Again, not doing that. <sighs> you sound just like that university ethics board. No matter. Return to the back burner and send me those samples. I'm running out of iridium, so I'm gonna make one last sweep for survivors. See you back at camp. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go ahead and pick up that side quest over there first. Rabbit Skags, my old friends. Said no one ever. You find. Hey, that's my land. Get away from that door. Uh, I thought I could handle living with this guy, but hey, what do you think you're doing? What you want? 
Because I ain't got nothing. Quit rubbing it in! Psst. Vault Hunter. I finagle this spot in Earl's bunker because I'm not messing around with crazy pants gas that turns people into plant monsters. But he doesn't have any food. You will assist me. Go get me some food. And you know you will be handsomely rewarded. Okay. I will go ahead and knock this mission out in the next episode. So, hope you enjoyed this one, guys. Really enjoying this so far. It's uh, <laughs> nice and... Nice to be back in Borderlands 2. It's been a while since I last played. I've been playing a lot of Borderlands 1 uh, Remastered lately. And it just made me miss the... Just how versatile the weapons in Borderlands can be. For instance, the... What are they called? Those SMGs. I think they're called Steel Anarchies. Um, you can use them for like... 20 levels and they can still be effective whereas in Borderlands 2 you pick up a weapon five levels later it's absolutely useless but whatever I'm not sure where that came from but anyway I hope you enjoyed like I said I will knock this mission out in the next episode so until then take care and as always I'll see you later